How can church discipline be loving? It's important to understand the context of Matthew 18. And when you take the passage of instruction on going to your brother and then including more and more people, the context is fascinating because it starts off with Jesus commanding us to take sin seriously, cut off a hand, gouge out an eye. But then it moves to the shepherd who leaves the 99 to go after the one. And, it, and, and we need to understand that the instructions or the, the pattern for church discipline comes in the context of the shepherd leaving the 99 to go after the one. And so within the biblical context, church discipline is a rescue operation. And so we need to understand that, that particular context. And then right after the instructions on, on how to go after a brother or sister, we have the parable of the unforgiving servant after Peter asks the question in very similar language, how often, you know, if my brother sins against me, shall I forgive him? And, and Peter is quite generous by saying seven times, and Jesus says, no, 70 times seven. And then you have the parable of the unforgiving servant. So the context of church discipline is one in which we take sin seriously, but also it's a rescue operation. And our posture is one of preparedness to forgive. And so, Church discipline is a rescue operation when one of our brothers, professing brothers and sisters goes astray, we're going after them to bring them back and to rescue them so that they don't shipwreck their faith.